our reef shark snorkel adventure. Again, if you swim with stingrays and you want to try to <laughs> everyone doing this, <laughs> nope, not doing that. Um, again, go do it. Again, I've done this in Belize. Again, I've traveled so many places, different ports. Um, so, so again, you get to see the reef, you get to see all the fish, the sea life, indigenous to the area there, Bimini, and then the sharks will be there as well. They make their home out of this reef. Um, trust me, it's really great. I've done it five times. I've done it five times with no issues. Um, it's fantastic. <laughs> Uh, I have them all. Calm down. I have them all. Uh, but yeah, still getting a great opportunity to go out there and swim with the sharks. Again, having a great shout out. I told you, do something that scares you. Do something different. Do something. Get on out there. Again, they'll feed you. They'll, you'll, they'll, they'll feed you. You'll feed them. Uh, and <laughs> Stop it. Uh, you'll get to feed them. You get to hold them. They'll touch them as they swim by you. Super gentle creatures. I'm being completely honest. They'll have some fun. They're used to human interaction. They do this all the time, right? They have tours that go out there uh, all the time. Yeah, having some fun there. And the next one is their Sapona Snorkeling Adventure. <laughs> Everybody excited to get in the water some sharks? Yeah. Why are we going out? <laughs> but you're going to get in anyway. The next guy, he's kind of like snorkel vest right now is Lyndon. He's going to be a shark wrangler in the water, keeping you guys, keeping you guys sick in the water from the sharks. All right, it's going to be a 25 minute ride to our spot. Once you get there, I'll give you a call briefing about what to do and what not to do once you get out there, all right? Everybody good? Yep. The room is right here, right next to me. That's served after. So if you, or if you don't go in the water, you can just look through the glass bottom and then enjoy some rum punch.